Hello and welcome to my full Zara haul. If you enjoy videos like this, please don't forget to subscribe and let's jump right into it. First piece I got was this navy blue knit sweater with this gorgeous puffy sleeves and round neckline and I got it in a small size. It just feels super soft. I love the long sleeves because, well, <laughs> this is always a struggle for me. You'll see later on with other pieces. Um, the golden buttons detail on the front just elevate this cardigan and I like the fact that it is a piece that will add a structure to any look. It is super versatile and easy to obtain a casual smart vibe when paired with any trousers or jeans. So it is a really good basic with the same details that will elevate any look. Next are these off-white trousers. These are a French size 36 and just feel super comfortable. The fitting is soft and right in all places and they aren't so thick as you can see. They're kind of a little bit see-through but nothing major that can be resolved with the right underwear. I just wish they would have been longer on me so I can wear them with heels but they're a good mid-season piece that can be styled in so many different ways. Love the detail on the bottom, you can wear it open or closed depending the look and fit you're going for. Another piece I got is this knitted sweater. This is more of a transitional piece as it isn't too thick. Um, it is quite cropped and I just love the relaxed fitting on it. It is a great basic to pair with um, paper bag trousers or cargo trousers as well and just jeans. I just really enjoy how romantic this piece is and all the details throughout it. Um, it just gives me that very like cool feminine vibe. One more basic I got is this solid black cotton t-shirt again. A layering piece you can dress it up or down as you can see here with a leather jacket or any type of blazer is a no-brainer very simple yet essential in my wardrobe love the high round neck and the lovely stitching details on top of the shoulders this kind of like adds interest to the piece this is in size small I also picked up this satin blouse. I really like this kind of dark floral prints for fall and winter. It has balloon sleeves and great detail on the end of the sleeves with these black buttons. And it has all the same detailing on the back of the high neck as well. Again, this is in size small. And I just love this piece because it just feels so elegant and timeless. Now we got this relaxed fit vegan leather trousers with a gathering on the bottom of the leg. Another staple piece for the season. I mean, leather to me instantly elevates any look and just makes you look super well put together. This can be worn with uh, t-shirts, shirts, sweaters. I mean, such a versatile piece that really gives you endless options on how to wear it. Um, the pants are in size 36 French and I just love how soft um, this fox leather feels and the loose and relaxed fit on them. Super comfy and I really enjoy them. Next is this gorgeous top with puffy organza sleeves. I just love this. When I saw this, I was like, I need it in my life. It's such a statement piece, very easy to style. The fabric feels so soft and I was pleasantly surprised with the finishing. It is just super well done and I really enjoy it. I think it's just a wonderful piece to incorporate in your wardrobe. Continuing with kind of the same thing with puffy sleeves, we got this denim box crop top, very 80s I would say. 
um, that I just actually realized that they sent it to me in a large size which as you can see is huge on me um, I ordered a small size but for some reason I got the large size and that's why I believe it just looks super big on me as you can see um, I like it in a combination with this high-waisted acid wash denim pants that I'm gonna show you in more detail right after this um, but I just need to get my right size definitely because I just need to see how it looks here are the jeans of the set and like I said these are an acid wash high-waisted jeans with a leg gathering at the bottom so they create a more rounded silhouette they go really high on my waist but feel quite tight on my hips um, I don't know these are a size 36 I tried out the size 38 but for some reason they were just huge on the waist and just very baggy and loose on the hips and I don't know I really think that maybe they will get better with some wear um, I mean I, I suppose I just have to see but I just really enjoy them I think they're super fun and cute and yeah I like the fitting and the shape of them I am trying to introduce more color to my wardrobe as you can tell I am pretty neutral with my choices and well I kind of went all for it when choosing this piece this is a neon rip top and I just don't like it I mean the armpits are huge it's really cropped this is a size medium by the way because the small size was just too cropped for me and the sleeves are too short on me as well um, believe it or not the color choice as striking as it looks it just didn't really bother me I can play with it in different ways and it's kind of fun to combine this piece with others to tone it down and make it look a little bit more classy and elegant but just the cut and sizing on the top not my favorite one one of the pieces I was the most excited about was this cardigan because I feel they're just great transitional pieces. They just make you feel super cozy and this one in particular, I just thought it was so beautiful. It looks super elegant. I love the big front pockets and golden button detail as well. The pattern just gives me those Chanel vibes. Um, I'm not sure though if the fitting is right in here. Of course it is an oversized cardigan but I just feel the arms are quite tight and I have pretty slim arms so it is something that I won't be able to wear with a thicker layer underneath. Um, I chose to pair it with a transparent bodysuit and some leather leggings. I don't know maybe I should go a size up with this one. This is actually a size small but I'm not sure as it is already an oversized jacket I don't know I also got a graphic t-shirt with New York on it of course love the fact that I found one with my favorite city in the world and I'm so into graphic t-shirts lately I just think they make any type of look fun and playful and why not a little bit edgy at the same time um, I'm planning to style this one with a pleated um, leather skirt and sneakers, um, leather pants and jeans as well, a blazer on top. I mean, there's just a wide array of possibilities. Another piece I got was this white cotton top with puff checker sleeves and I love tops like this because they're kind of like my basics for every day, but they have a distinctive factor in them. Um, this one is the sleeves, of course, and I just feel that they're pretty basic, but they have some detail on them, um, so they just make them look extra special. And yeah, I really like the feeling of the fabric. It is super soft and comfortable to wear. Um, they're not the longest though, they're quite cropped, but you can still tuck them into your pants or any skirts and I love as well the round high neck, especially for the season. Um, so yeah, this is another nice piece from Zara. 
And to finalize this haul, my favorite piece is this knitted sweater with this beautiful ruffles detail all around the shoulders and chest. It just feels super soft and cozy and I'm just super in love with the color. It is a pastel soft lavender. That color, especially for winter, is just everything. I couldn't resist. I know that it isn't so cold here in Dubai during winter, but sometimes, you know, especially on those winter months at night, um, it gets really, really chilly. So one of these pieces is something that I need. Oh my God, I just love it. It is so beautiful. It is such a statement piece, but it just feels so relaxed and romantic at the same time. It's just great. So that's it with my full Sarah haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, as always, please don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you know exactly when I post my next video. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you soon. Bye!